Hey guys, we are here with another episode of RT Trio. And I'm going to reach around behind me and grab a few things I've gathered. Inspired by the mood board created by Bea. So here's the mood board for this month. Um, if you want a copy of the mood board or you want to see what myself and my collaborators are doing um, and what other people are doing and sharing in the in the and we have a Facebook group and so join the RT Trio Facebook group if you want me to see your post to make sure that I see your post then um, tag me in said post family is um, messaging each other so sorry about the ticking in the background um, I as I've said pre previously, use my art journaling in particular for um, therapy. And almost always my work has, when I do it, especially in the journals, has words in it. And um, especially it seems like when I'm doing the art, these artsy trio collaborations, don't know why, but that's, and that's a, totally okay with me. Um, I like working through things in my journals and being able to work through it, get it on the paper, and then close the journal up and stick it on a shelf when it's done and full. So um, this month, inspired by the mood board, I picked these three colors of paint. And I happen to own one gelato. I'm not a huge gelato fan. I got this at um, as a sample at CHA years ago. This is the color snow cone. Um, so one of the things I like to do besides use my journal for therapy is to um, grab those art supplies that I, I don't use enough and um, use them or try them in the journal, see if I like them or not. Um, so we are gonna, I think, work on the gray side and put our notes and things on the white side. Um, I do Usually when I do these, we'll flip back a few pages. I put the mood board and notes on what I used in the piece on the on one side and then the actual work on the other side. Um, that helps me just work through different arc techniques, how I'm feeling, different supplies, and deciding whether I like things or not. There are videos for all of these if you want to look on my channel. All right, so recently I found um, a bunch of um, Hawaii stuff from a trip we took a few months ago that I forgot I had. It was packed in a um, pocket of a suitcase and we were getting ready for another trip. And I'm like, oh, guess what? I forgot it was in here. Um, I really, this is really speaking to me along with this. So before we do anything else, I'm gonna cut these out of my mouth and then I'll set them aside. And um, I have two stencils here. I do design stencils, although I'm not currently selling any um, at the moment. That could change at any time. Um, but at the moment, I'm not selling them. Anyway, these are two stencils, uh, Palm and Shine Bright. These are intended to go together. We are gonna use them that way. And we are gonna see where this leads us. So I'm gonna cut my collage bits out here. I'm going to do it quickly and semi-straightly, hopefully. But you know, my art is about therapy and experimentation and not about perfection in the slightest little bit or meaning of that word. Um, I don't, I don't know how to do that, so, anyway. Uh, okay, there we go. Alright, so I'm going to fast forward through this next part, and I'm going to turn on some music, and I'll be right back.
I like it. Uh, why did I create the page this way? No idea, but it felt right. Sometimes they're not, you know, pretty masterpieces and they're just expressing how I feel, but that's okay with me because that's exactly what I want. Um, life's a beach, shine bright, but first learn how to swim. <laughs> I mean, you know, gotta learn how to swim life's oceans, right? Anyway, I would love to see what you do with this month's mood board um, in your journal, on a canvas, in fabric, whatever um, way you choose to do it, in whichever form you choose to do it in, I would love to see what you do. Watch the other two videos in the video description down below and the links are there. The link for the Facebook group is down there too. Um, join us. If you do post something in the Facebook group, tag me in the post. If you put something on YouTube, you can send me the link. And uh, yeah, I would love to see what you're doing. This is it for today, and I hope it gives you some ideas of what you can do. Go check out Bea's Mood Board and in the Facebook group, and yeah, go out and have a great day. Do something nice for yourself, because you do deserve it. Just first learn how to swim. All right, that's it for now. Bye, guys.